subscribe now. <laughs>
is more than what we think. She has a superior power that is covering her. There is nothing I can do. Kete, but you cannot tell me this. I mean, it is no longer about sleeping with this girl. It is now about pride. That girl insulted me. She humiliated me. I need to take my pound of flesh. Don't you get it? I need to... Make her pay. Get it back. We have to make her pay. The only solution to this problem is if those things around her neck and hand are removed. That is the only thing that will make the child to work. Staying here and crying all day won't help the situation. I advise that you take your mother home while you go look for the money. Okay. Then why, why don't you try Chibuzo? Yes. Amara. He's the, he's, he's the only option left now. Amara, please, see this. You and I know that all that man wants is to sleep with me. I can't go close to him. Ngozi, I believe Chibuzo will consider the case of your mother's condition. There is a little good even in the worst human being. Higgy might consider. Let's try him. Mm. Tamara, look at your mother. What exactly did they say is wrong with your mother? They said it's colon cancer. Cancer of the large intestine. And they are requiring a huge amount of money for the surgery. How much? The money is very big. <laughs> Ngozika, your own is to mention the amount. Mine is to bring it. How much are they asking for? You are a Christian, aren't you? I am. Tell me how much it is. What happened to your faith? Uh, they said one, one million, eight hundred thousand naira. <laughs> That's why you're killing yourself. Is it not huge enough? You know what? I have somewhere to go. When I come back, I will call you. Okay? So you can come over hmm? and we'll talk about it. Alright? Hmm? Thank you, sir. We're not done. Now you, are you feeling the way? We're not done talking. About. You just said you have somewhere you want to go. No, not like I'm I'm going right away. I, I can, you know, buy a little time. But I still have to go and visit my mother at the hospital. Okay. I'll take care of you, sir. Yes, come in. The door is open. Wow. 
on my lips. Sit down. Feel at home. Relax. Hmm? How are you? I'm fine. Feel comfortable. You. Is that your test? No, I'm not. I'm very fine. Okay. Just feel at home, eh? Oh. All you need to do is just to feed in your name. Hi. I hope you have an ID card. It, it, um, yeah, I think I do. My God will bless you. Thank you very much. Don't thank me, thank God. Oh. No problem, thank God. Let me take it. Okay. You know, they say nothing is free in life. A bile of my letter. You know what I mean? I don't understand you, sir. I'm telling you, baby. <laughs> How can you not know what I'm saying? Eh? Okay, let me make it very simple and clear. Hmm? Take off your clothes, everything. Hmm? Then you come and sit on top of me. Panye mukwa. Kama kisi we wadumi. You honestly want to sleep with me? Because you want to save my mother's life? <laughs> Honesty. I like the sound of that. Honestly. But it would be callous of me to just sleep with you because I want to help. All I am asking for is a little appreciation. But the difference is that nigga chake. And it becomes icing on the cake. You're a heartless man. <laughs> You are not just wicked, but you are insensitive. You, you want to sleep with me because you are mature to save my mother. Really? You know what, sir? Thank you very much for wasting my time. I don't need your money. What in hell with it? Wicked man. Hell, who is this hell here? You are in hell, I am in hell, obviously. So you should say that to yourself. How could he be so heartless? So heartless! How? It's okay, Ngozi. You, you just have to stop crying. Yeah? What do we do now? I don't know. And my mother's condition is getting worse by the day. God, please, do not allow my mother to die. Don't allow her to die. She will not die. Remember all her services in your vineyard. Please don't allow her to die. What do I do? It's okay. She will not die. Yeah? Let's have faith. God will do something, oh? You know, God, she will not die. It's okay, it's okay. I just hope so. She's getting worse. She's getting worse. Hey. Mom. It's okay, it's okay. I've brought your medicine. Get up. Mama. The medicine is here. Mama. Mama, can you hear me? Mama. Ah. Mama. Mama. Mama, Mbana. Mbana, no. Mama, look at me, Fabiko. Mama. Mama. Hey. Mama. 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 Mama, what are you doing? 
for me now. What I, 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 I brought the drugs. The drugs you asked me to drink. Mama! Hey! Hey! Mama, 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 please. Mama, you can't do this for me. Mama, you cannot do this to me. You can't do this. You can't do this. I brought the drugs. I brought the drugs for you. I brought the drugs you asked me to bring.
wrong with you? I've been trying to get your attention. What is the problem? I uh heard. -huh. I heard you. Eh? Mr. Chibuzo, why will I stop for you? For what now? Yes, my boss. What is the problem? Mr. Chibuzo, what is this mother is there? Oh, one name. Eh, oh, one name. That's all you have to say. That's all. You have all it takes to save that woman's life. But you never did it. Because you allowed your wickedness, your selfish desire to overtake you. Wicked man, if you stop me on the road again, eh, what I will do to you will never I shall you. If you stop me, eh? Hey, this is not good at all. This is not good at all. Oh. Hi. Gozika, how what? are you? What are you doing here? I heard about your mother's death and I feel I should, you know, come and pay my condolence. 
Uh, it's rather unfortunate. It has happened. It has. Yes, it has happened. But, come to think of it, Mwazi, you claim you loved your mother so much. But it was difficult for you to pay little sacrifice to save her life. And what I was asking for wasn't too much, was it? What sacrifice? <laughs> you know what? You are right. Yes. In fact, I blame myself for not giving you what you wanted in exchange to save my mother's life. Mm. I mean, it has happened. Mm. And I cannot undo what has been done. Mm. Mm, so... It, it's, it's in the past. Uh, it is. <laughs> we can have a fresh start. Indeed. Um, I cannot leave you standing like this. Please, let me quickly get it for you to sit down. Okay. <laughs> By all means, please. Okay. <laughs> Everything happens for good. At least. She's <laughs> ready to think like that. Oh! Oh, no! Dressed yet? Are you not going to church? Today is Sunday now. Ngozi, since Mama died, you stopped attending mass. What's the need? Eh? What did you say? Eh? Yes. What is the need of saving a God who turns away from you when you need Him the most? Tell me. What is the need of saving a God who allows bad things happen to you? What? Ngozi, you of all people should know that everything happens for a reason on this planet Earth. So why blame God? If I do not blame him, who should I blame? Should I blame you? Eh? Ngozi, dress up, let's go to church. <laughs> Please. Mama, you're wasting your time. Huh? I don't I don't I don't have time to be doing all this. I'll see you when I come back. Relationship with the power that is protecting her is gradually going down. This is the right time to strike. My daughter, you have not been coming to church for some time now. Some church members visited you that I was not satisfied with the reports I got from them. That's why I came to find out what is going on. There is no problem, Father. I've, I've just been busy recently. Busy? With what? I've been busy with so many things. Busy? So busy that you neglected the presence of the Lord? Have you forgotten what the scripture said? I was glad when they said, let us go to the house of the Lord. But that is the point. I am not glad. As a matter of fact, I am filled with so much sadness. There is no way I can go into the house of the Lord without having this feeling of disappointment. 
the Lord disappointed me. Father, he failed me. God did not fail you, my daughter. He failed me. If he did not fail me, why did he allow my mother to die? At first, it was my father. My mother was very sick and needed financial assistance. Even the church could not help. And you're telling me to come to the same church? How do you expect me to do that? Um, my daughter, what happened to you? Father, it's okay. I don't need you to explain anything to me. It's fine. Okay. I think you need some time to clear your head. I'll take my leave. But I may visit again. May I go be with you. Subscribe now.